Hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to slash welcome back to Cryptarch. So I played this game a bunch back when it came out two and a half years ago, and then kind of dropped off as I was waiting for new patches. And so the game is finally fully out as of today, July, July June, June 20th. And let's take a look. So, co-op campaign. I assume it's local. I gotta look at that. Yeah, it's local only. Okay, well, whatever. Anyway, uh, so we got campaign mode, which I don't really know how campaign mode works, but I was told we should do rogue. I haven't exactly been paying attention to the newer versions, so we'll figure it out. Anyway, oh, so we get artifacts to unlock different things. So we've got, I kind of took a look at these. We've got the standard gunhead, which I'm used to. Start hull 10, base loadout cost 155, quickly dodge incoming projectiles. Blockade shield, extra baggage, six item slots, salamander, afterburner, two news boost that projects damaging flames. Yeah, some of these look interesting. However, I can't use them, so we're just going to go with the gunhead. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything particularly fancy about it. Oh, there might have been uh, different skins. Well, whatever. Too late now. Oh. Do I have guns? No, it doesn't look like I have guns. Okay, destroy the core. What? Oh. Okay, we don't want to go in that direction. Um, Can I check the map here? This is interesting. I'm not used to this. Right, I don't have guns. Of course I don't have guns. Let's see, I'm trying to... Trying to remember, uh, we are timed here, so I should probably stop faffing around. Oh, so much. Let's not go in the Security one with all the mines. Okay, do we have anything in here? I'm trying to figure out. Well, we do want to be next to the shield core. In retrospect, this might not exactly be the best. Well, we're fine. We don't have the shield yet, which is rough. Usually, I'm able to choose a late lo uh, load out here okay well oh that's so much nicer looking okay we should we gotta kill him first okay we're good to go oh right doesn't roguelike mode make it so you um you have to shield find the guns generator. while you're out and about oh I forgot shield generator systems might do things um, this is new. I security was, systems shuffled. No, I was not aware of these things. Okay, so we've been shuffled. Okay, can I? I don't know what's going on. I think they're fixing it. Maybe I can't get out of here. I'm so confused. I've oh, well, prepared. let's heal, but I I don't remember. Okay, let's check the map. I think we're doomed. Okay, so we've got hazard system. Yeah. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. Let's abandon this game. Let's start over again. I, I remember. I'm 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 remembering now. For a second I thought it was throwing us in with the Oh, we do get extra skins. That's cool. Let's go with rental. And let's try let's try again. Hopefully we can uh, skip the dialogue. Yeah. Okay, so I don't care too much about the dialogue. Let's actually take a look at what we got here. So we've got suit upgrade, speed loader. That's kind of useful. What's this? Artifact pod. Okay, repair supply pod, item pod repair, hazard system. Okay, controller for the ship's hazards spawns mines. Will disable all mines once destroyed. Weapon, close combat, repair system. Yeah, so we have to, we have to take out the repair system. That's what we... Ran afoul of last time. Door control. Uh, we're probably going to want to go after the drone factory. 
We also have something near the alarm. Nitrous oxide fuel. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm going to bump in, grab the upgrade, and then we're going to go around for the upgrade pod. Okay, so this is mine. Okay, speed loader. Replacing receiver and feed belts with superior aftermarket brands and modifications. Rate of fire is increased by 20%. There we go. Perfect. And we leave. Before they can do too much damage to me. Um, yeah, I don't know if we're timed at all here. But that's okay. Yeah, roguelike mode is different. They ha they hadn't added it. Um, oh. Tab for map. We're gonna hook that in. There we go. Uh, they hadn't... Oh, this is new. Uh, they hadn't added it in my uh, previous playthroughs versions. And so I'm not exactly used to any of these things. Okay, so we do have a... We do have a heal upgrade. We have a lot more traps. Uh-oh. I don't know what those are. These, like, weird jet-looking things look worrying. Okay, cool. So the repair repair thing does not uh, heal itself like it used to. So you got a hull repair, which I don't really care too much about one way or another. Oh! Got one of those guys. Up. Oh, crap. Okay. Oh, I've got the spike. Oh, wait, no. I got the shield! Mouse three for for spike. Okay, well, we gotta... We gotta kill this sucker. Ow. Okay, let's heal. Let's grab a key. Let's grab close combat. What do we got? Tractor beam. No. Okay, so we gotta keep going up this direction. We've got a key, but that's fine. It's not... That's not what I'm worried about. I don't know what those are exactly, but yeah, we gotta kill this. This is spawning infinite uh, goons at me. Factory system neutralized. There we go. Okay. Took some damage from that. Uh, but yeah, we don't have to worry about too much. Holy crap. Okay, we gotta, we gotta go for that mine layer system. Luckily, it's back down this way. Key code recovered. A lot of key codes that I can grab. Key code recovered. Be awesome if I could actually get them to carry over with me. Okay, how do I how do I kill this thing? Oh, open. Okay, did I? Take some hits from that, or... I don't know. Okay, one way or another, we've got plenty of keys, and we no longer have to worry about the landmines here. Still got some healing left, though I'd like to avoid using it, if at all possible. Yeah, so we do have the right-click um, for shield. Oh, that's Key not a mine. And we also don't need to worry about mines anymore. Okay, so what do we got here? We've got a shield system, a whole bunch of enemies, door lock... Already, already got the upgrades. Um, repair supply pod. Item pod. Hull, oh, item pod hull repair. Okay. Well, I guess let's head for the shields. Unfortunately, the debris in the way. Is not marked on the map, so that's going to be... That's going to take a little bit of getting used to. Ow. Well, that's... This is... This is fine. This is fine. Okay, item pod hull repair. So let's grab that. Oh, weird. Hull repaired. And let's repair. I'll get better at uh, this whole fighting thing at some point. But for now, I'm just kind of bamboozled. Oh, so... By... That's interesting. By taking out the hazard system, it actually took out every single hazard. Well, that's appreciated. Shield generator system okay, so there goes the shield generator. Here's an artifact. Pod. Wrong button. Okay. It would seem that we're not the first invaders to visit this fleet throughout the years. These chitinous shells appear to belong to an entirely separate alien faction. Unlike any 
any of the other materials we've recovered. Raiders, predators, or simply curious explorers. In any case, the fleet security systems made short work of them. Uh, let's hope we don't share their fate. Okay, one way or another, we got an artifact. Artifacts are awesome because they let me, um... I got a friend coming in. Uh, artifacts are awesome. They let me unlock things outside of combat. I don't... Or outside of combat. Outside of regular gameplay. I'm not really sure what they all do. Okay, so that's an, another item pod for hull repair. So we want to pick that up. Originally, I was being, um... Uh, I was being, uh resistant to it because it didn't seem that not that useful uh i just uh i try and be conservative with what i've got but it looks like we're good we're gonna need a new weapon though um i'm running out of machine gun ammo we do have the spike which i can use i'm not exactly keen on using it but i can use it okay so the brain's gonna start going after me. Well. I guess the spike received a bit of an upgrade. Ow. Stunned me, I guess. Okay. So do we have... We do have a new gun. Okay, let's grab the weapon bot over the machine gun. Medium machine gun. Smart. Okay. Um... I guess we'll just start shooting some of the brain. I'm gonna take out this side of the brain, plus this guy. I don't want to kill the whole brain. Because I want to run out of... I want to use as much of my ammo as I possibly can. Okay, cool. And let's replace the uh, machine gun with the smart machine gun. Fire grenade. Okay, let's see if we can spike it. Spike! Nope, can't spike it. Okay, well that's unfortunate, but we're done. And we didn't use too many bullets there. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't let me go back for all the goodies. Okay, let's check the map this time. So we've got sentry systems, so we've got turrets to look out for. A couple of upgrades. Hazard system. Seems like it's worth it, because I think these are a ton of landmines. Let's just make sure we don't have a repair system lying around. Yeah, we do. Oof. I guess it's not that far in, and there aren't that many landmines. We've got to take out the repair system first. Everything else becomes our oyster past that point. And it does look like we get to carry our keys over between runs. Well, that's actually rather handy. Oh, you're a serious problem. Okay. I guess I can use melee on this. I guess I'll just shoot it. I'm trying to be I'm trying to be cautious, but it's not flying the way I want it to be. Okay, e I gotta take this out. Unfortunately, there's so many shots. Okay, repair is dead. Let's heal. Okay. Okay, so I guess next up, what do we want to do? Let's check the map. This got hectic in a hurry. Alright, so we want to go for the turret system. Stay away from him. Oh, mine system. That's not, that's not what I like to see. Luckily, we'll go for turrets and we'll go for hazards and life will be much easier on us. I'm just going to use some of my explosives. Oh, no. I got a smart... I got a smart gun. That's really dumb. Forget how much I liked the music on this. 
Okay. But yeah, unfortunately the smart gun will shoot at whatever it wants. Which is not actually as good as I'd like it to be. Okay, now will that shoot through walls? No, it will not. Okay, that's good. What the fuck? What is it shooting at? Okay. I have no idea. It it was shooting at things that were like outside the level. That was worrying. Well, we might as well heal up. There we go. Okay, no more sentries. We're good to go. Unfortunately, I'm at a third of my ammo. Um, we gotta head down for hazards. What? Okay, bad news. We might have a second turret control here. Yeah, we do. Guess I'll have to go for that. Um, nah, let's cut around. I'm trying to be cautious, because one, I suck at this game. Two, I don't get a choice for uh, equipment like I used to. Which makes this like a thousand times harder. Oh, that's a new one. This is all new. Okay, there we go. I got gooped. Owie. But that does shut down most of the turrets. Hopefully it doesn't make them visible either. Actually, oh. Super convenient thing. We don't actually have an enemy spawner here. Okay, that kind of makes up for a lot of trouble. Let's go back outside. Take the coward's route through. Yeah, I, I want to take out every possible danger, and then we uh, then we go for the things. Yeah, I used to kind of time trial my way through this game. Sort of, you know, go quick and not have to worry about stuff. I have since decided that that is a terrible idea. Where'd, the, where'd he come from? No idea. Okay, so you want to go here. Down, up, up, down, up. And there we go. Okay, so there goes the hazard system. Let's keep picking up keys. We should probably pick up as many keys as we possibly can. Okay, so the turrets are down, so we get a weapon pod cannon. Auto cannon, 100. Um, let's get in instead of the high explosive grenades, I think. Oh, repair supply yeah. pod, which I probably should have actually waited on. Whatever. Okay, so let's loot. Let's start looting this place. Because we're gonna need goodies. Rocket, drunk rocket. Hold on to that. I like the auto cannon, but ammo is uh, not what it used to be. Uh, let's see what's this artifact pod. Okay. Let's see. Oh, sensor suite. Uh, what area? Oh, when facing a jammer system. I'll grab it. I don't know how many um, upgrades we can really load up on here. Okay. So I'm going to just destroy. Okay, we've got a nuclear demolition charge. Yeah, I'll get it instead of one of the fixes. Okay, so if I just pop it right there. Oh, I see. I'm just gonna escape. Shield generator system neutralized. Okay, so I've only got one more of those. I'm not. I don't think I'm usually going to use those, but they're good for taking out a couple of systems that we don't care for. 
All right, uh, let's see, what else do we have around here? We do have item pod hull repair. So we gotta go for that, especially because shields. What's this? Weapon pod projector. Hull repair. We want the shotgun. That's a good replacement for what I got. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I might be scored on time in the end here, but like, whatever. I, I'm finding myself uh, in a position of not caring too much. Okay, so let's get a hull repair. Now we've got two. Nice part is we literally do not have Shield generator any uh, any enemies left. Well, we don't have any threats. It would have been bad if there were double turret, hazard, and uh, double turret, hazard, and uh, what am I thinking? And an enemy spawner. Or multiple repairs. I mean, there's there's a billion ways that this game can be really, really mean. So yeah, let's just pick up some more keys and go around. Yeah, I really like this game. I think I almost prefer classic mode, maybe. Maybe not. Uh, classic mode was, I think, maybe more interesting for me just because um, uh, you got to select your build. I think this having to deal with... Uh, Having to deal with uh, everything uh, being kind of limited here is throwing me for a bit of a loop because I don't get to uh, I don't get to come up with like fun crazy builds along the way. But I have to say it is a much more roguelike uh, experience this way, which is definitely a positive thing. Projector, slime projector. I mean, we could get rid of the ram spike for it. Or we could, we could slime up the, let's slime up the boss. Okay, let's grab another hull repair. Okay. Yeah, let's go, let's go slime us up a brain, uh, most of the way, and then I'll take out the, uh, let's see, is there anything left? No, it is literally just the brain. Okay. Yeah, I'll just toss a bunch of slime in there, uh, until the brain's almost dead, and then we'll go, then we'll go repair. This is the right, right room, right? Yeah, I'm not against the slime projector. It's just not an interesting uh, weapon half the time. It, it, I prefer the immediacy of other guns. For what should be fairly obvious reasons. So yeah, we'll just pull the same trick that we pulled on the last fight. Okay, I think that's good enough. Oh, especially because, wow, the slime projector has already run out of uh, half of its ammo. Key code recovered. I don't know how many of you guys saw my old series, but uh, I had... Ooh, frag gun. Yes. Okay, uh, we had a pretty good uh, setup with, uh, what is it, quad guns? Like three or four guns at a time. And usually I'd stack enough ammo that we had nothing to worry about. Cortex call. System neutralized. It was super, super enjoyable. This game doesn't exactly let me do the same thing. Which is, a, well, this mode is uh, doesn't let me do the same thing. Which is, I don't know, a shame? Maybe not. Okay. Well, what are we up against this time? I see one repair, one bot, two shields. Oh, nuclear deterrence. Okay, and... Oh, it's one of these. What else we got? Failsafe. Assumes the function is the last destroyed system. Oh, we might be in trouble here. Okay, cool. So I can get to the failsafe and the repair pretty quickly. Wait, what? Don't lie to me, game. Okay. Luckily, I've got tons of ammo. Okay, so we gotta go right past the. F we gotta go right past the brain. Okay. Nope. Oh, I can destroy this. Yes.
What is this thing? I have no idea. Well, it's not hurting me, so that's that's a good sign. Okay. So we gotta run. Because obviously, we've got, uh... We've got no good nicks on the... Security systems on the run. Shuffled. Okay, um... That's bad. That's real bad. Okay. So we got something major to worry about. Oh, thank you, frag gun. For those of you that don't know, frag the frag gun is amazing. Okay, so that's the alarm. Don't care. We're just... Sprinting for it. Ow. Okay. Okay. There we go. <gasps> okay. So we've got this system flipper. Right here. Okay. Can I? Neutralized. Cool. Alarm Gonna just trigger the alarm again, running away from these nukes. We are having a bad day. Ah. This is why I prefer to bring my own guns. Especially because some of these enemies are not exactly... Uh, easy to spot in these setups. Okay. <sighs> Breathe. Okay, so we killed the shuffle system, so we gotta get out here. How much ammo am I looking at? 12 shots for the frag. I wonder if I can cycle my weapons. Can they just... I think they can. Okay. I repaired. Guess I'll go with the fix. Um, yeah. So we gotta we gotta take the item. Uh, enemy spawner. That is 100%. Do not pass go. The most dangerous thing here. Uh, alternatively, it's shielded. I was not paying attention. Okay, that's bad. Yeah. Uh, the longer I leave that thing running, the more enemies we end up here, uh, end up with here. All I gotta do is kill it. Luckily we got the autocannon or a nuke. It'd be real nice if I could just, well, I could maybe nuke the shields. Okay. I guess I'll use the frag gun. System neutralized. Okay. Unfortunately, the uh, nuclear deterrent system is a uh, little bit bigger than my own nukes, which is frustrating. Oh, well. Okay. So now we can go after the enemy. Oh, crap. Okay. So let's do three. Open. Up. Left. Left. Up. Factory. System. Neutralized. Okay, there we go. There goes the drone factory. Um, what are we looking at here? Got a lot of goodies, but we gotta hold off on them. Should probably go for the nuclear destruct. Actually, no. How many systems do we even have left? One failsafe alarm. Okay, so let's... Or not failsafe. Um, well, yeah. We've got the nuclear failsafe. Oh, right, that's their own. I'm just gonna hang out here for a moment. And wait. I'm completely out of goodies. Okay. Yeah, we want to take out the, uh... My... The mine-laying system. Uh... The mines, the traps, all of those goodies. There we go. Oh. You. There we go. I'm, I'm learning how to spike better here. It's appreciated. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we killed the hazard, but we haven't killed the uh, the other hazard. <laughs> Too many hazards. Okay, but 
Yeah, we got this. I was worried for a hot moment there that we were completely doomed. This is uh, not a level you want to encounter. The only thing that would have made this worse is if it had cloaking, which does not bode well for uh, for our, our next run here. Because we've still got two levels after this one, and if this is what we're up against, who boy is going to be rough. I guess I can take out the shields while we're here. We won't have much left to bug me past this point. Looks like not a whole lot of enemies have moved back into this zone either. Nuclear defense there we go. System ah, it's still going off. I guess one final hurrah on this thing. Okay. Did that work? I don't think it did. I don't think you can spike retaliate those guys. Okay. Well, we're good. Unless there's another nuclear deterrent that I haven't seen yet, this is fine. There we go. Uh, can I can I punch this thing? No. Well, that's frustrating. It'd be really nice if I could get an ammo thing for this gun. I really like the frag gun. Ammunition depleted. Unfortunately, no dice. Okay, hazard coating. Uh, let's see. Fire and corrosives. Cool. I don't know if there's a limitation on how many of those I can equip. There used to be, but there might not be anymore? I don't know. Okay. Well, I'm a little bit wounded. That's not a pod. Um, hmm. What are these things? Bumper. Oh. That's different. Okay, so what do we got? Item pod, alarm lure... I mean, effectively, I'm going to have to raid this place for goodies. Oh. Okay. Those guys are jerks. Everything is a jerk. We'll be okay. Let's see if we can get around. I need a new gun. That big pod thing likes to create these, like, little... Little guys that bite at my ankles. Not exactly something I want to deal with, especially on limited health. I assume I don't recover between runs. Oh, this is gonna suck. Okay, that sucked significantly less than I, I was expecting. Okay, yeah, it'd be really nice if I could get like a... A recovery thing. Okay, so we don't care about the alarm lure that much. What else we got? Another hull repair. And the shield's down there. We're gonna need weapons. We've also got a ton of things there. Okay. Uh... You know, let's get back up here. Let's go check out the uh, energy thing. If I remember right, energy things don't run out of ammo. They just have a recharge time. Makes them pretty reliable, especially in runs like this where they don't hand you ammo anymore. Okay, I guess I'll wait until it stuns itself. Dude's just too jumpy for me. Yeah, part of the problem is we've got all this debris that the enemies don't have to deal with. I hope they change that, honestly. It seems a little bit unfair to me. Okay, weapon pod energy. Storm hammer! Uh, sure. Why not? It's not like I'm using the frag gun. Okay, so it's got quite the charge time on it. Okay, I guess I'll just keep using the spike. For better or worse. But yeah, I'll just keep going around. So we've got to have a couple of goodies that I can grab. He wasn't paying attention. Yeah, more for me. Okay. Yo, what? There we go. 
I, I think I hit myself with the autocannon. How's the autocannon even doing ammo-wise? 87 shots. It's not bad. Well, we get an artifact pod. This cybernetic circuit module was pulled from one of the more aggressive alien specimens. Its programming contains behavioral parameters that aren't at all unusual for robotic AI, but... Digging deeper, I found the root operating architecture has a disturbingly organic pattern. Almost identical to a natural... Okay, so we're hurting. Can I, can I switch my items around? Okay, let's try this. Let's switch the sticky grenades out for the auto cannon. Boop. That was dumb. There we go. Okay, so now I got the auto cannon as a regular weapon. We're hurting. Uh, a lot of it's my fault. Okay, we do have a machine gun here. If I want to do that, I just don't really want to get rid of the spike. Okay, let's go take out the shields. Oh, no, this is a weapon pod shield. Hostage shield. No, hostage shield isn't so good. Okay. So I've got one more hull repair there. Let's go for the hull repair. I gotta, I gotta load up on recovery, cause uh, whew. I'm not gonna use one though. We we have a, a hull repair module that I can go use. As long as I don't die in the next like short bit, we're we're good to go. Man, I remember the auto cannon doing a lot more damage. Oh, jeez. So that fires junk at me. Worrying. I like the auto cannon quite a lot. Lack of uh, the uh, lower amount of ammo makes it a little bit harder to work with, but that's fine. I do kind of wish I could um, swap inventory stuff around manually. I don't see the ability, like I don't see anything that would let me do that, unfortunately. Oh, that's fine. Really liking Spike. I was not expecting I'd enjoy Spike as much as I do. Okay, so now what do we got? A uh, bunch of keys, bunch of random junk, an alarm system. We gotta kill the alarm. There's too many enemies left on this ship, and if I, if I don't, we are, we are in the badlands. Okay, so we got a big end. There he is. Whoo! There we go. Okay, I should probably clear this area out a little bit before. Before we go for that alarm. Okay, now can that hit me from here? Yes. I'm sorry. There's one issue with the auto cannon. Can blast self. Alarm system neutralized. Okay, running out of ammo for the spike cannon, but at this point that's okay. We've got close combat weapon over there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go take a look see. Maybe we can replace the spike with something a little bit more handy. Oh, nope, we don't want to go this direction. Really see the chuckers is that dangerous, but they can. And we should probably also get some HP. Because I've, I've got two HP left. I think there's... I think you can get down to, like, uh, ultra emergency flashy flashy mode. Uh, before things become, like, really bad. But I don't want to do that. Really don't. Okay. So what are we looking at? Close combat pod... Ripper saw, sure, why not? Let's try it instead of the ram spike. Might actually be more useful. I part of the reason why I don't like the uh, the spike. Ooh, recharging. Oh.
Does it come back on its own or do I have to use it up? Okay, it comes back on its own. I think I'm going to commit to it just because. It seems pretty kind of useful. Wish it's uh, cooldown for recharging was maybe a little bit faster. Okay. How's my shield doing? Shield's probably fine. At least most of the enemies are just these guys. This game has always had kind of low enemy variety comparatively. Okay, so we do have a rocket pod that I could nab. I'll consider that. Let's go get healed first. Yeah. Oh, it heals me up to full. Okay, that is actually incredibly useful. So let's zoom out. We want to get this. We've got another hull repair thing. Maybe some other goodies. So let's just get out of here. Yeah, the music for this game is amazing. So if you guys haven't heard of uh, Cryptarch before this, these are the people... Uh, these are Alien Trap that made this. Um, if you guys haven't heard of them, uh, they're the people that made Apollyon, which is fairly famous-ish? I don't know, it, it got really good reviews back in um, back in 2014, I think, when it came out. Um, I never played Apollyon, but I did play this, and I was actually a pretty big fan. Unfortunately, I think it uh, still has the same problem of being rather difficult to specifically watch. Uh, I heard a lot of complaints that it was not a, it was not an easy game to, to view. I guess we'll be using the HP bot down here. That's oh, okay. We've. Cannon ammunition depleted. We've got one. Oh, that was just a big enemy. Why did I even? I have no idea. Okay, so I'm out of ammo. So that doesn't work. Well, I've got sticky grenades. I'll just use those. There's, there's another weapon around here that I can pick up. Okay, so let's get the repair supply pod. I'd, I'd grab it later, but we're not going to be back. Okay, so we've got a machine gun all the way up here. Yeah, we do also have rockets. Honestly, I think I'm going to stick with the sticky grenades. R. Uh, just because I don't have anything... I don't have a good reason otherwise. Mainly sticky grenades are reliable. Rockets scare me. I guess honestly grenades scare me too. Well, uh, at the very least we can go get a machine gun. But yeah, I think in the future I'm probably going to just go back to, to regular play on this. Uh, the roguelike mode seems neat, but one of my favorite parts about the regular mode was just... Mix and matching the most ridiculous guns that I could possibly like jam on onto my uh, my suit and run around like that. Hopefully, I can farm. Uh, hopefully, I can farm artifacts in regular mode. It'd be kind of a shame if I couldn't. Can't imagine that it would limit me like that. And that also gives us a heck of a lot more um, opportunity to check new things out. Okay, so we just get a heavy machine gun with ricochet. Uh, let's find our way down to that brain. All right, yeah, we we'll want to go outside for this. That is completely understandable. At least we're going to be able to come out of this run specifically with uh, quite a lot of. Uh, we'll be able to come out of this run with quite a lot of uh, artifacts to unlock some things. But I'm not entirely sure how much there is for unlocks. It looks like it's mostly character class. Or suit class. And maybe that's about it. Which is actually rather helpful. Okay, I'm just gonna rip saw through these things. I want as much room to maneuver as I possibly can nab. Okay, there was something back there that shot at me. Or I got hit by one of the brain waves and I wasn't even paying attention. No. Oh. I'm shooting at me, sort of. I think I might need to change my uh, cursor color here. 
I wish the machine gun was one of those where um, it uh, it became less accurate the more you shot. System neutralized. Uh, currently, the way it works is uh, it's just crazy and accurate, period. And it'd be kind of nice if, like, popping off the occasional shot would actually make it uh, decent, decently more accurate, I guess. I don't know. Whatever.